Looks like the system is starting to move south. It's already fizzling out. Yeah, we're drying out for most of the Las Vegas Valley. So we told you yesterday, small window opportunity between the hours of about 2 a.m. to 6 a.m., but most of us are dry in the Las Vegas Valley. We're still dealing with a few tapering snow showers and rain showers uh, in Boulder City, but it's already really starting to dry out. So most of the valley is completely dry outside. Mountain Springs, maybe a few leftover snowflakes, but other than that, it is just completely dry now in the Las Vegas Valley. Dolan Springs to Kingman dealing with maybe a little bit of snow showers. Searchlights still snowing out there in the higher elevations. Also, Gene getting a little bit of light snow, uh, but the drier air is moving on in. And we'll be looking at a few clouds to start off our morning. Other than that, it's going to be a beautiful sunny day as we head into Thursday. Besides the wind, we got to get through the wind. We have a wind advisory until 10 a.m. Thursday morning. Northwest wind gusts around 45 miles per hour, but sustained winds around 20 to 30 outside and already seeing a, a, the wind at a good blip 17 miles per hour in Henderson, 22 in Kingman and 10 in Boulder City. So everybody's above 10 miles per hour for some of the wind speeds, uh, but the wind gusts are going to be the bigger issue out of the Northwest. We're looking anywhere from 25 to 35 miles per hour. Peak wind gusts today going to be late morning by noon. We start to turn the corner and then heading into the rest of the afternoon and evening. We do look at some calmer wind, so we won't be in the thick of the wind all day long. It really peaks for late morning right around noon. Current temperatures outside 30s and 40s, so a lot warmer than yesterday. Yesterday we were in the 20s and 30s. Uh, now we're starting to get a little bit better in the 40s outside, but it is going to be warming up in the low 50s again today. Uh, with the help of that northwest wind, wind chill you got to think about feels like temperatures. It's going to feel a lot colder outside with the help of that northwest wind as we get into the rest of our morning. Forecast temperatures tomorrow. We are looking at starting off very cold. We'll be right around 30 degrees by 7 a.m. Make sure to bundle up tomorrow if you're planning to be outdoors early. We are looking to stick with the 40s through 11 a.m. and they'll break out near 50, but calm winds expected for the rest of the day on your Friday. So as we take a look at future track already looking at those clouds left over by 6 a.m. expecting to see those clouds around sunrise, but 10, 11, 12 o'clock into the noon at noon time frame. We're looking to really stay with the dry weather. So we did clear things out very fast and take a look at your first alert calendar Thursday and Friday looking at a rain snow mix, uh, but Friday is going to be dry cold morning. So we are looking at temperatures starting off in the 20s and low 30s tomorrow. Most of us will be below average. Uh, the weekend looking great Saturday and Sunday. No major impacts in terms of weather. If you do have any plans to be outside, just got to dress warmer morning drop off about 37 degrees. We are drying out now, so I'll go ahead and change that icon. It's already gone southeast of us and then afternoon pickup mostly sunny 51 degrees outside wind speeds around 10 to 15. They'll be dropping as we head into the rest of the day. So as we take a look at the rest of the forecast Friday at 52 cold starts with temperatures in the low 30s below freezing. And then we're back in the mid to upper 50 Saturday and Sunday. We'll get more sunshine heading into the holiday for MLK Day on Monday at 57 degrees. And then we're holding on near 60 as we head towards the middle of next week. We'll be right back after this break.